Hey guys, it's Jill down at Redwater Dodge, home of the $10 oil change and rig ready Rams. I'm here to show you this 2019 Ram 3500, so let's take a peek around. So under the hood, you're gonna have your 6.7 Cummins. Uh, it pretty much speaks for itself. I don't really have to talk about it, so. I realize I'm matching this truck right now. Um, obviously new front end, 20 inch rims, uh, tow mirrors on this one. They have a new uh, style running board. I actually really like it. Crew cab long box, kind of unusual. You don't get long boxes in a lot. So come snatch it up while you can. It's also got the camera up there for the hooking up your Fitz wheels. Um, backup camera here as well. Um, and you're going to have your spray and box liner. Always handy. This truck also has park sensors all around. Um, other than that, I mean, you know, we have really good deals on these, so you guys should come on down. All right, guys, welcome inside the 2019 redesigned Bighorn. This is kind of my favorite package if I was gonna be buying a diesel or just a truck in general. Uh, this is probably the one I'd buy, kind of the best of both worlds and you're not paying for too much, but uh, you're also not getting too, too little of options. Uh, first thing you're gonna notice is this beautiful redesigned 2019 uh, premium cloth bucket style seat. The nice thing about this one, it has got a little bit of black, a little bit of gray all throughout it. Um, and it also has the same stitching pattern that you're used to in your diesel, three cushioned bottom, two rear, great back support with the bucket seat as well. And again, you can fold this down however you want, however you like. Um, you can fold the back obviously a little bit more too. Um, again, first thing you gonna notice, Bighorn, obviously nicely uh, badged throughout the vehicle there. Lots of storage in this vehicle, not to mention. Um, and the first, another great storage bin is the brand new redesigned center console. Flip this up here guys, again, leather wrapped. Uh, nice charging deck here, USB, two little ports there for it. Um, great thing about this as well, it's all rubber so you can take that out and clean it. It does get sticky after a while, I think most of us can agree to that. A nice little uh, kind of carpenter slash working, uh, working man section here. This is uh, all the stuff you'll need. Uh, tan, cosine, sin, or sin, sin yeah. A squared plus B squared equals C squared. Uh, Pythag Pythagorean theorem, I think it's called. And then uh, just down directly below here again, more tons of storage. A little divider in the middle you probably won't be able to see that in the video but trust me it's there this is a three-way center console so just like this i can adjust it however i need it uh located on here nice little storage bin again with with rubber i can pull that out if i had to um change compartment two cup holders there's a little bag in here too not too sure what that's from probably the steering wheel want to make sure it's uh, kept nice and well phone holder 115 volt just directly below that there guys two usbs two uscs and aux cord um, just directly above it guys, front and rear park sensors, which is nice. You're driving a big long box uh, diesel. You want to kind of be able to see where you're going. Uh, trailer brake in this one as well as it has the tow package on the exterior. Uh, J brake tow haul just directly there as well. And this, it's kind of really cool uh, this year. It reminds me like a fighter jet or something. I feel like I'm in World War II, but um, I'm actually just in a 19 redesigned Bighorn. Uh, dual climate control just directly above that, heated end. Uh, heated seats, heated steering wheel, 8.4 inch Uconnect system with built-in navigation. Uh, you can also control your climate control there. This one even has the cargo camera too, which is pretty nice if you got a nice load in the back there. Check out the cargo camera, make sure it's not sliding around or if you wanna hook up uh, your trailer nice and easy. You can also zoom in on your hitch um, or just see where you're going backwards as well. This one also has the built-in travel link, so that's gonna be able to show you fuel listings, movie prices, sports scores, the weather. Um, and even traffic in your local city as well, which is nice. Um, again, it's got the also built in um, owner's manual, which is cool as well. You can even search so you don't have to dig through your owner's manual for a certain area. Wi-Fi hotspot built in as well. So this is a pretty loaded up truck, guys. Sirius XM radio, one year for free. Um, obviously there's Bluetooth this, in this one, and then we saw all the USCs and USBs down directly below. Um, how you control your four by four, four by low, simply just push on the button there, hold it, it's going to shift in there for us right now. You might hear a little noise underneath the truck and boom, I'm in four high. Push to start in this one as well. Le uh, leather wrapped steering wheel. It is heated, of course. And on the back of the steering wheel here, I even have audio controls for my 8.4 inch Uconnect. Well, that's a good song. I can even change the radio station if I wanted to. I'm just going to take my select source off here. Uh, let's say I'm not too big of a fan of Lady Gaga, but who isn't? And boom, I can change it there. Uh, even you've got your brand new redesigned uh, digital speedometer here, guys, which is nice. Uh, tons of features in here. My tow haul, I can set up different trailers for different modes. Overall, tons of customization. Shows me the fuel range, uh, fuel economy, all the type of great stuff is located in here. And again, tons, of, uh, tons and tons of customization if I need it. Power windows, power locks, power mirrors, even power folding mirrors, which is nice for tow mirrors. Kind of a rare feature to find. Uh, power rear window as well. Defrosting as well, I must mention. 
And then your assist and SOS just located up here. Sunglasses holder, pretty standard stuff. Um, and even a universal garage door opener. There's also Alpine stereo system in this one. So the better of the two stereo systems you can get in the Bighorn. Um, and then this kind of mahogany wood theme all throughout the vehicle as well, which is really nice. But that's the front seat of the vehicle, guys. Kind of in a nutshell and a Reader's Digest kind of version. Let's check out the back seat. All right, guys, in the back seat here, this is the crew cab. It's a huge back seat. As you guys can see, I'm just kind of chilling back here. Um, and remember, I was sitting in the seat. I'm a six foot giant, so I had it pretty far back. And I still have, you know, like a fist or two uh, length of room. Very comfortable back here. The roof even slopes in a little bit here. I got the Alpine stereo system on the roof as well. Um, and again, it's this great style uh, premium bucket seat. Uh, cloth of course and it just looks it just looks really clean really nice fold this down the middle here guys two cup holders there um, You can fold this up, which is really cool. I got the flat deck system in this one as well um, If you want to put a dog kennel dog cage, or maybe you just don't even want your kids feet hanging This is also a great feature just for that Directly below that there guys tons of storage under my seat and then under this seat here has the alpine built-in uh, subwoofer just under these mats here guys fold that up you're gonna have in-floor storage uh, these are a bit uh, bin style storage containers so those can come out they can be used as a cooler they can be used as just a great place to put jumper cables or anything you don't really want kind of laying around the truck um, you have this nice little center console it's attached to the obviously the driver center console two usbs two uscs 115 volt right there dual climate controllers even a tablet holder in here you can throw your tablet and watch a movie back here with the kids two cup holders there two cup holders there and then two cup holders there so there's a total of six cup holders in the rear which is insane you could probably even throw a couple cups um in the door if you really wanted to as well this is also power folding or not folding power windows in the rear this mahogany style wood all throughout it as well um, and there's even some more storage there. So there's tons of storage in these vehicles, guys. They're really comfortable. Um, like I said, you know, I'm at the dealership every single day. And personally, I would probably buy this trim level myself. It's the best of both worlds. Uh, you get the options you want and you don't really have to pay for the ones you don't want. So it's a great vehicle here. Um, yeah, we'll throw it back to Jill and she can tell you you can purchase this. So if you guys want to make this truck yours, you know what to do. Give us a call 780-942-3629 or shoot us an email, sales at Redwater Lodge. See ya.